Dogman is a werewolf, or a werewolf type creature, that was first reported in 1887 in Waxford County, Michigan. Sightings have been reported in several locations throughout Michigan. The legend of the Michigan Dogman gained popularity when a disc jockey recorded a song about the Dogman and its sightings. Steve Cook recorded a song named The Legend with the keyboard backing and credited to Bob Farley. After he played the song, Cook received calls from listeners who said they had encountered a similar creature. In the next few weeks after Cook played the song, it became the most requested song in the radio station. He also sold the cassette songs for four dollars and donated the proceeds from a single to an animal shelter. Over the years, Cook has received more than a hundred reports of the creature's existence. Cook later added verses to the song in 1997 after hearing a report of an animal breaking by an animal that was a unknown canine at a cabin in Luther, Michigan. He re-recorded it again in 2007 with a Mandalian backing. The first sighting of the Michigan Dogman occurred in 1887 in Waxford County when two lumberjacks saw a creature whom they described as being a man with a dog's face in 1938 in Paris, Michigan. Robert Forty was attacked by five dogs, wild dogs apparently, and said that one of them walked on two legs. Reports of similar creatures came from Algon County in the 1950s and in Mantee and Cross Village in 1967. Linda Godfrey, in her book The Beast from Bury Road, compares the Mantee sighting to a similar creature sighted in Wisconsin known as the Beast of Bray Road in 1961. A night watchman was patrolling a manufacturing plant in Big Rapids, Michigan, when he saw a particular figure. At first he thought it was a person until he saw the dog-like features. He pulled his gun and was about to shoot when he remembered his camera was on and took it out to take a picture of the horrific beast. The photos have not been analyzed yet and the photos still remain an unsolved mystery. In 1987, Steve Cook recorded a song about the sightings of the supposed Michigan Dog Man, which he intentionally played as an April Fool's joke. However, he did base them on actual reports of the creature, so I will leave this up to you. A ninjin is a cryptid that is located in the oceans of Antarctica and southern Asia. It has several appearances and it's at least 20 to 30 meters long has many appearances and has a white skin. It has many appearances, including above and underwater appearances. The Ninjin has been described as a, a humongous, well-like creature, a very smooth, pale-like form, resembles the head, torso, and appendages of a human being. That having been noted, there are some eyewitnesses who testify that it has a mermaid-like tail rather than two hind legs. Others who insist that they resemble hands, complete with five fingers. These beasts have supposedly been seen in the Pacific, Antarctic, Antarctic and Atlantic Oceans and have always been described as being extraordinarily large with a whitish com complexion. Many observers report that they have no distinct facial features except huge eyes and a mouth slit 
According to most accounts, these creatures are primarily nocturnal and tend to thrive in frigid Arctic waters. Initial reports of these creatures generally emerged from the tail end of the 20th century, which is strange considering the mystery, considering the mysteries of the undiscovered land masses at the time period. But I will leave this up to you. Are these creatures true or just a hoax?